This is the brand new Tahoe 550 TF. As you can see, there's a trolling motor, so it's probably a fishing boat, but it also looks like a classic runabout. So which is it? Well, actually, it's a bit of both. This is their fish and ski model. It has everything the family wants for fun on the water. It also has a lot of very cool features for anyone that loves to fish. What I think is the coolest feature is the full-on fishing seats that are stored in the transom locker. Pop the stand out of its secure holder in the in-floor locker, pop it into the bow slot, then slide the chair into the stand. Remove the protective cover, flip the back up, and bingo bango, you got a fish boat. There's a spot at the stern as well, but at the bow you also have the trolling motor. No excuses not to land that trophy catch. Without the fishing seat, the bow is comfy and has the underseat storage you expect on a classic runabout. Moving back, the port console has stereo controls and a good sized glove box. The helm is clean, modern and user friendly for either booting around with your family or taking your buddies to your favorite fishing hole. All controlled from the comfortable bucket seat with partial wraparound support and stylish two-tone to match the hull. Stretching across both is a wraparound windscreen. There are intuitively placed grab handles along with combing storage for your extra gear. Bench seating at the stern conceals a storage compartment on the port side, a live well on the starboard side, and in the middle, room for a full-size cooler. And behind that, removable cushions make the transom a roomy and cushy sun pad, and a bimini top for when you've had enough rays. Even with the new outboard options, this Tahoe fits very functional dual swim platforms, the starboard side having a ladder, and the port side with storage though both have cup holders for water-based loungers of your group. As tested, we had a 150 horsepower Mercury. It had plenty of power for water sports or to race across the lake to chase that trophy catch. The 550 TF gets on plane quickly with a whole shot under five seconds. And once running, there's no stopping you. With two people, it easily cracks 51 miles per hour and feels comfortable running at speed. Fully loaded, it won't quite crack 50, but will still top out in the very high 40s. Impressive for a 150 horsepower engine. Testing in the Arlington River between Lake George, Florida's second largest lake that can get whipped up with wind, and Little Lake George, the boat traffic can be busy as it's a popular fishing spot, but the wider, deeper, and longer hull means you can confidently handle the chop, and when it disappears, you definitely want to punch the throttle of this Tahoe and enjoy skimming across the top of the water. Not so much a concern today with mostly clear skies, bright sun, and 85 Fahrenheit temperatures, but the high windscreen is something you'll certainly appreciate on colder runs at the start of or end of season further north, or if you're heading out for crack of dawn fishing adventures. The wind only brushing the top of my head at six foot one. It handles smoothly with the 150 horsepower Mercury providing solid power to drive the well-designed hull through confident turns. It's one of the best executions of a fish and ski boat that is designed with the family first. Classic runabout fun with the trolling motor, seats and live wells for the functionality of a genuine fishing boat. The Tahoe 550 TF tries to be everything to everyone and does a remarkable job of doing just that.